Hello everybody, this is Luciano from Touch Tap Play and today I'm here to share with you some tips and tricks for this amazing game that is called Tap Tap Trillionaire. I've already uh, shared the gameplay video with you but now I want to share with you my progress and uh, share some tips that will help you uh, get rich fast, fast, fast. Okay, so let's go. This, this just happened, I was just going to tell you about this. Um, it seems that every now and then you will lose money. Your traders lost, lose a lot of money and you have the chance to recover the money. Right now I lost a big amount, 700 or 700,000 because this piggy guy is not having it. So. What we can do is to recover the money right now, and I will do that. I am spending 5 diamonds for that, and I am always doing it when a huge amount of uh, cash is involved. But let's check out this girl. This girl only wants me to invest 36 and I will get 45. She has a success rate of 39%. I would not do this normally, but because I'm not going to lose a lot of money, I will buy this. Why? I will risk losing 36,000 because of the achievements. Have you checked the achievements? No, probably not, but here it is. We have achievements for uh, a lot of uh, trades, invest artifacts with traders, invest bonds with traders, stocks with traders and so on. You're getting 5, then 10, then I don't know what's the final one, probably a lot. Um, either way, you are getting rewards in diamonds for investing with your traders so you should always take the deals when they when, when when the risk of losing money is very very slow very low sorry so this girl lost 30,000 uh, 13,000 sorry it's not a big problem I will not uh, pay to get that this guy now will want a huge investment 750,000 it is all based on the amount of cash you have on hand. If you have 6,000, the investors, the traders will come and require a 6,000 investment. If you have 5 million, they will risk all the money. So it's always a good idea to keep your money low, wait for anybody, any kind of trader to come and try and give, make you an offer and take it just to complete the achievements and get the free diamonds. You have here four special uh, I don't know how to call them, uh, special skills that you can upgrade in the first section. I'm usually keeping those active uh, because the trader will visit every now and then. And when the trader visits, you want to have these because they require you to get to make an amount of money in given seconds, you know, in any given seconds. Right now the trader is coming and you can see I'm only making 59 uh, coins per tap and he will ask for me probably a lot let's check out he wants me to earn 32,000 as you can see by tapping I might not get there in 30 seconds even though I think I will in this case but the, the, the trader is usually asking for a lot more and then I will use one or some of my uh, uh, power-ups and it's f five easy gems or diamonds or whatever and you're also getting 10 cards that you can invest let's see what the piggy did he did okay he made me a profit of 250,000 this guy wants to buy again I will risk the hundred thousand just for the achievements sake I will not uh, get this because it might be a video so we'll ignore it for now so uh, here are the boosts as you can see I have up upgraded all of uh, the, the three last ones at level 4. The ka moment gives you instant cash and uh, recharges every 10 minutes so it's nice to upgrade it a bit more. And of course this is your main character, how much you're earning per second. The more you upgrade it, the more money you're making, but you won't be tapping a lot uh, in this game after a while because you will have a lot of money and something else will matter. So we had a profit, he succeeded. Next we have the traders. I will share with you some tips here as well. As you can see, I have uh, traders at different levels. There are two types of traders. Traders, they, they have different stars, as you can see here on the left side. We have Wolf of Door Street, who is 
a four-star trader, we have a two-star trader in Savannah, two-star trader in Jerome, Mrs. Chip and so on. The deal is that as soon as possible, as soon as the game starts, you should hire all the traders that you can. You, you can get a maximum of eight traders, never more, never less. Uh, less, yes, you can less, but... So, you can never get more traders than eight. So you should fill the positions because each trader will give you some income per minute. Level them up, even if, it, if, even if they are one star or two star traders, it doesn't really matter. Level them up to get some money every minute and then wait to get 75 diamonds. And as soon as you get 75 diamonds, you hit the get traders button and you spend the money to get a four or five star trader. Let's get one right now and I will show you what to do. We got, we got the sheep again, I have her. Let's see what happens. Okay, I never been in this situation before, I didn't know this is possible, so this is not a great deal because I already had the ship, and for 75 diamonds I got 100 books. That's not a great deal, but well, that's life, you know, it happens. Usually you will get a trader, as you can see I have 5 traders of, that are 4 star value and uh, none of 5 star value. You have to keep on trying, spending the 75 uh, diamonds to get new traders. Once you do, I was hoping to be able to uh, show you that, but it's not possible. But once you get a trader that is uh, that has more stars, four or five stars, you can fire your existing traders. Let's see Sydney. Simply tap her, tap the, the trader that you want, and you then select send on no pay leave. Once you go there, the her office will be empty and you can hit the switch trader button and you have more traders here you will select your four star trader or the best trader that you have in our case it's sydney because well she was the best okay so do that do that in order to maximize because every four star trader or five star trader will have a skill wolf of door street has a viciousness which uh, makes investors appear more often uh, we have the Mrs. Ship that increases books earned after trader completes a trade by 25% and so on. Every trader has different skills that are extremely, extremely useful. Let's see, she managed... Whoa, she managed to do it. Okay. And now we will... Oh, oh here it is. Do I have any chances to complete the trader? Let's see if we can complete the trade with just one active skill. Uh, it just gives me some uh, money every second, not a lot, but I think we will be able to do it. The idea is to tap as much as possible. So let's tap, 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 tap to become a trillionaire. Okay, I did it. I, I got five more diamonds and we're back to the tips and tricks. The most important part of the game is, of course, the trading and buying of stock. As you can see, whoa, everybody's doing great every stock of mine is doing really great here and usually used to see a bit of more red but here it is i will just sell the gold bars right now do i have time yes there's a minute i will i will spend some time here to explain you you, you can see the trend the trend is the most important thing that you can look at that and you should always look at it before making a purchase because it shows you the the the, the history of the stocks is not as important as their price you know as you can see we have more bars here on the trend and uh, when I uh, and at the bottom is the lowest price that the action uh, that this these stocks will sh uh, the shares sorry will sell for and the top of course is uh, the maximum price that they can get they will never get cheaper than the minimum and they can never get and you will never get more for the than the maximum and right now we can see that the gold bars are selling at the at the maximum price that they will ever ever sell that's 2,500 uh, coins or whatever per share and I will sell them right now I bought them for 1,000 and I'm selling them for 2.5k so it's a good deal I'm making a profit of 146 percent so the same goes for every, every, every type of stock. You see, the trend doesn't really, really matter. All it matters is for you to buy when the price is the lowest possible. 
For the Roman County wine, for example, I bought them when they are 6.9, you see, when, when, when the bar was there at the bottom, that's when I bought them. They're now 9,000, I would make a nice profit, but if I wait, eventually, the price will go up here, up to the top, and when it goes there, I will make a lot of money, so I have to wait, there is no reason not to wait, there is no hurry here, you know. You might want to go for the quick profit, Whoa, the cracker cola is selling at the maximum again, so I'm going to sell that. You might go for the quick profit eventually, because, well, you have to do something, you know. Right now, here, I bought them for 35 uh, and they are selling for 98. I can sell them right now, you know, to get the quick money, go to the buy trade item, check the bonds, for example. The money supermarket is selling as a minimum. Oh, I wanted to get everything, but I already had them. Uh, and simply check the trend for every type of stock. This one is very pricey, I just sold them, so I'm not going to buy Zurich ins insurance is uh, at an all-time high, there is no reason to purchase. Let's look at something, the slab on cards are cheap now, not the cheapest price, but cheap, so I'll get them because I will most likely get a nice profit here. Let's see the stocks, you will remember uh, the prices. Face look, face look was down, it's at 8. From my own experience, it rarely gets to a maximum, so I'm not going to buy any. But here is the blue bulls, they are at the bottom, so it's the best time to purchase the action, the stock. Sorry, I, I, I keep selling actions. Okay, we will ignore the trader right now because we have to look at the uh, stocks right now so this is what you do this is this is the most important thing that you have to keep an eye on buy when the trades are lowest and you don't have to guess or or I don't know or uh, um, remember write down the the prices they're all here in the trend button buy when the trend is shows you that the prices are the lowest and wait and sell them when you have a profit. There's no hurry, there is no, there is absolutely, absolutely no rush to sell quickly, you know, buy quickly, sell quickly. Every now and then your trader will fall asleep. It happens. You can either tap him to have him return or he will get back alone. Okay, another thing that will tempt you is buy any of these stuff, you know. You you can improve your office a lot. As you can see, I bought a few stuff, a few things for for my uh, office because I've been playing for for a while now. These things don't. I don't think they really really influence the game. Let's see. Getting the fast computers. As you can see, you, you can't tap them. You can't get anything. I think they're it's it's just the design. You know. Let's get the fast computers for one million. I'm going to spend the hard earned money right now and we, we we simply have them as you can see here i'm not sure if they help the, the traders get more money now it seems that they're not getting more money per minute it's it's pure design so my recommendation would be to simply ignore most of these uh, things that you can buy for a long while because you're not getting any bonuses from switching them you see but there is one which is the here the coin flower here you can buy the coin flower and it gives you 100 coins every minute i'm not sure if the cheerleader secretary or any other any of any of these other uh, guys will give you any sort of bonus but i'm sure that if the traveling salesman arrives and makes an offer for you to get them you you will see you will know so these might be worth investing in if you have the cash. And finally, what you should uh, do here at the traders, you should upgrade them smartly. You will most likely use and keep using the 4 star and 5 star traders if you have any 5 star traders. So you should focus on upgrading them. A 4-star or a 5-star trader starts with a success chance that is always higher than that of a 
uh, two star or one star trader which makes sense so as you can see right now my wolf of door street uh, is level 17 and has a 53 success chance while savannah is level 22 so uh, she's five levels higher than the previous one and she only has a success chance of 40 percent uh, that is because she's a two star compared to the four stars Upgrading a 4-star character costs more, but I think that it is important to upgrade and spend every now and then money. You, Whenever you level them up, they only get 0.5%, uh, so not a lot. You will have to spend a lot, a lot of money to actually level them up and uh, get them to uh, have more success when trading. But that is the only way to do it. Don't hurry, though. There's no rush. Get them to over 50%, get them to level 17, 20, and then work their way up slowly as you get more money. Uh, but focus on on these 4-star and 5-star ones, because you will eventually get enough diamonds for free or for cash, and uh, you will replace your low-star low ones anyway, so there's no need to invest more than you should in that. Or at least this is my opinion, this is how I play the game. And as you can see right now, I have 1.3 million uh, worth of uh, shares that just dropped to 1.28 million. I have 5 million in the bank. I have upgrades and I will keep getting them because I love this game. So these would, would be my tips and tricks for playing the game. Uh, hopefully they were useful. Hopefully you can put them to good use. I think that the most important things are uh, looking at the trend of the uh, stocks that you can buy, uh, keeping your skills uh, ready for the investor because that's five diamonds that you will get for free and quickly, and then uh, leveling up your your traders smartly. I don't really think that this matters uh, a lot, how, how you spend your books on, just I want to go for, you know, I will always go with the most expensive, keep them to uh, same levels, you know, uh, get those to, I will get those to 5, then I will get this to 12, then whenever I feel like it I will spend some more uh, books to level up my uh, coins per tap. But I'm not tapping a lot anymore, I'm keeping an eye on the, the stock market. This is what you will do too, so thanks for watching, this is a great game, keep on playing and have fun, see you soon, bye bye.